Dear friends, welcome back to Automate with Rakesh. In this video, we are going to learn some of the questions and what should be the right answer and why the other options are wrong around the state machine. So let's get started. The very first question, which of the following is a characteristic of the final state in a state machine? Options are must have at least one transition configured from the final state now for this to understand this what you do simply drag and drop a state machine scope and a state activity and a final state just connect to it okay so what are the question we'll understand the very first point it says must have at least one transition configured from the final state no see if you open final state you don't have transition so from the final state you can't have a transition it, that is the end that is the end but from a state activity you can always have a transition right you can't have a transition inside a final state you can only have entry so that means this statement is wrong option number two a state must be connected to a final state now what is the understanding on this question is for example a state is connected to final state now you might be having a question what if i am having another state in between that is also possible right a state is connected to this state and instead of this transition let's say it is connected like this from this one to this one so it is talking about the overall project a state must be a state at least a state single state should be connected to final state you might be having multiple state activities but a single state activity should be connected to final state which is right at least right a state must be connected to final state so this statement is correct now let's look at why these two options are wrong that is very important during the exam to understand what is correct and also to understand which options are incorrect so this is incorrect now let's look at the third one a final state can only transition to another final state activity no final state is end it doesn't transition so this is also wrong now a final state contains the transition and the exit section this statement is also wrong because in the final state we only have what entry so what is the right answer this is the right answer let's see the next question a process required by the finance team was developed using the state machine architecture one of those states needs to be able to transition to four other different states so it is saying let's say there is a state activity from one state activity it has to go to four other states okay so it should move on to another four different states okay and all are connected to the initial state something like that okay so it is going to four different states based on the business condition based on the condition in which of the following should the transition logic be introduced where before it moves from one transition to the other transition right where do you put that logic okay let me clear it it is too much okay for example this one okay just take this example from one state it has to move to another state so where would you put that business condition okay in which of the following should the transition logic be introduced so when it transition you click on this transition activity and inside this transition activity you put in the condition right this is where you put the logic based on the condition it will move so the condition is the answer so here if you see option number one in the entry action of the target state where it has to go no this is wrong right in the exit action of the source state no you don't put a condition there so it will only transition remember in state machine from this state it comes to this state based on this condition so the answer is always condition so this is wrong this is wrong in the trigger section of the transition this is also wrong not in the trigger section i'll show you how to use the trigger section but the answer here is in the condition section of the transition okay you always put it in the condition section based on which it will move now let's see one more question in uipath state machine project which activity is mandatory as top level container for defining the overall structure 
and organization of the automation process. So it is talking about you have a state machine, the top level container. What is the top level container? Sequence, state machine, flowchart, while loop. Of course, the answer is state machine. State machine itself is also an activity which works like a container, right? State machine itself is an activity which works like a container. So here your answer is state machine. All right, guys. So most of the relevant questions on the state machines we have covered. Let's move on to our next topic.